The toxicity of benzene. Benzene is an aromatic hydrocarbon that is both synthetic and naturally occurring. It is used to maintain high octane levels in gasoline, as well as functioning as a strong industrial solvent and a component of commercial cigarettes. These uses all contribute to the presence of benzene in both air and groundwater pollution. The absorption of benzene is facilitated by its physiochemical properties, including a hydrophobic log POW of 2.13 and its small side chains. These properties allow for simple diffusion of benzene across cell membranes from multiple forms of contact respiratory in the alveoli of the lungs, dermal through the skin, and digestive in the stomach after ingestion. Benzene is distributed throughout the body by systemic circulation, crossing membrane barriers through simple diffusion and targeting the liver and bone marrow. Metabolism occurs in both the liver and bone marrow, where benzene is oxidized by cytochrome P450 to produce multiple metabolites, including catch-all trihydroxyl benzene, phenol, quinol, and p-benzoquinol. If metabolism occurs in the liver, the metabolites are either excreted through the urinary tract or end up in the bone marrow. In the bone marrow, they undergo a secondary metabolism by cytochrome P450 or myeloperoxidase, MPO, which add hydroxyl groups to form genotoxic quinones and reactive oxygen species. Both of these metabolic products target bone marrow pluripotential stem cells and lymphocytic cells through binding to cellular macromolecules such as proteins, DNA, and RNA. The genotoxic quinones directly cause accelerated destruction of blood, known as pancytopenia, development of anemia, and bone marrow failure, which leads to infection with leukemia. Reactive oxygen species, ROS, cause DNA damage in the form of single and double-stranded breaks, as well as dysfunction of the machinery of cell cycle arrest through exertion of negative effects on P53 and inhibition of repair mechanisms. How these metabolites exert their toxicity is a twofold process. Metabolic production of quinones participates in redox cycling, causing the formation of reactive oxygen species and oxidative stress, while also covalently causing damage to be caused within the cells of the bone marrow. The reactive oxygen species also exert inhibition of P53 through control of RAF and DMP1. The inhibition of P53 then inhibits cell cycle arrest, causing mitosis to be dysregulated while also inhibiting the process of apoptosis or programmed cell death. This allows for the damaged cells to be replicated, allowing the genotoxic effects listed earlier, pencytopenia, anemia, and leukemia, to take effect. Benzene is a chronic toxin. It can be stored in tissues with high perfusion rates or high lipid content, such as the kidney, the brain, and fats. Exposure is a risk factor for everyone, but is particularly adverse for those with metabolic hyperactivity, as well as those with compromised hemoglobin, due to the fact that both conditions accelerate the toxic effects. Once damage to the bone marrow is extensive enough to cause anemia, it is irreversible without medical intervention, usually by bone marrow transplant. Benzene is being phased out of commercial solvents, but is still present in groundwater runoff and pollution, meaning that contact with this toxin is almost inevitable in most urban areas. This has been a Toxicology 3991 production, fueled by caffeine and irritation. More videos can be found scattered throughout YouTube covering a variety of toxins and their mechanisms. Citations for all information found in this video are available in the box below.